let's get started so here int i a variable i has been declared for i is equal to 1 so this is where the initialization is done this is where the value of i is getting initialized now we are starting our discussion so our decision of making uh, iterations again and again by this initialization i is equal to 1 now once after the initialization the condition will be checked so what is this condition i less than or equal to 5 what is the value of i the value of i is 1 we are going to check whether the 1 is less than or equal to 5 is it true yes it is true the value of 1 is less than or equal to 5 now once this is true we will enter into the for loop and this part will get executed one will get printed in your uh, uh, final output now after completion of all the statements all the all the statements within the for loop has been executed now the incrementation is done the value of i will get incremented okay now what is the value of new value of i previously this is one now after incrementation it will become two now we have to check the condition again so what is the condition with the value of i new value of i two less than or equal to five is it true yes it is true so this is true now we are going to print the value of two now again the incrementation the need the last so the again after completion of all this the incrementation is done now it will be five now five less than or equal to five is it true yes it is equal less than or equal to so five is equal to five so this is true this condition is true this is what the condition is this condition is true we are going to come into this loop and we are going to execute print five and next iteration so as we are done with all the statements again we are going to this is very important see here again we are going to increment so the decision is made by this conditional statement whether to iterate into this for loop again or not the decision is made by this conditional statement so the new value of i is 6 try to understand this concept this is very 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 important concept okay so now the new value is 6 now we are going to check the value of 6 less than or equal to 5 is it true no it is not true because the value of 6 is greater than 5 